And welcome back to the vlog. So I like to start every vlog off with something unique, something funny, just something that's gonna grab your attention. And so that clip, I was flying my drone and I, I was backing away from these horses and the, the horses are like chasing my drone because very curious of it. Yeah, and then I smashed right through a barbed wire fence. <laughs> Busted all of its propellers. Fortunately, it still works. Replace her propellers, she still flies. But anyway, on to today's vlog. So I love food and I've always splurged on a pretty big variety of granola bars and different energy bars to take on whether that be a day hunt or multi-day hunts. Today, I'm going to do a cost, weight, and calorie breakdown of everything that I currently take and then I'm gonna compare that to trail mix. And spoiler alert, the differences are pretty shocking. You can save a lot of money by going with trail mix. Here is the bars that I typically pack with me for a day hunt. <laughs> Pro bar meal, three honey stinger waffles, a 10 gram honey stinger protein bar, Cliff Whey Protein Bar. In total, these cost $13, there's 1,280 calories, and it weighs 9.5 ounces. So per day, I'm paying $13 for basically 1,300 calories in really high quality energy bars. So this isn't an exact science, but trail mix and all of the different fun things you can add to trail mix basically equates what you would have in an energy bar with you know, all the different fruits and nuts and chocolates and whatever. It's basically all the same stuff. It's just like the raw ingredients. So as a cost comparison, I got a bunch of different types of trail mix, all sorts of good fun stuff. And I'm gonna do the same cost, calorie, and weight comparison with that. First up, Kirkland Signature Trail Mix. Then we've got Kirkland Signature Cashew Clusters. Spicing things up with some shelled pistachios, dark chocolate covered acai and blueberries, milk chocolate covered almonds. And we'll go real crazy here and we'll add some wasabi peas for a little kick. All right, so the results are staggering. For energy bars, I'm spending almost $13 a day to get basically 1,300 calories of intake. To get 1,300 calories worth of trail mix, I would save almost $9. It costs $3.31 per day to get that amount of food. It's crazy. Obviously, a guy can't eat trail mix or this mix of trail mix every single day for like 10 days, so you're gonna have to change it up, but I think that if you really wanna save some money, adding a lot more trail mix and reducing the amount of bars, I think is gonna be a really good call in the long run. All right, that is a wrap for today. If you like this vlog, please hit the like button. That'd help me out a ton if you wanna see more, hit subscribe. We've got a lot more utility, kind of value add type of vlogs in the works. So we'll see you next time.